Purgatory Ski Resort has opened for the 2021 season amidst a surge of COVID cases in southwest Colorado. And resort officials say skiers and snowboarders need to be prepared to spend the day outside. You're watching the Local News Network, brought to you by True West Auto of Durango and Cortez. I'm Wendy Graham Settle. Purgatory Ski Resort opened with one ski lift, six trails, and a 16-inch base of mostly man-made snow on November 21st, a normal early season start to the ski season. What wasn't normal were the face masks, the socially distanced lift mazes, and no one allowed inside except to pick up pre-ordered food. That's skiing in the time of COVID. Ski resorts statewide have been allowed to open this fall with appropriate pandemic practices approved by the Colorado Department of Public Health and Environment. Purgatory received approval for its COVID plan just days before its scheduled opening. The good news? You don't have to make a reservation to ski, but you will have to purchase tickets in advance, and they're available only online. You also must make reservations in advance to rent equipment or to book a ski lesson. Purgatory will offer the new reloadable Purgatory card to purchase tickets, rentals, ski lessons, and more. And season passes will continue to be available for purchase online. When skiers and boarders arrive, drivers are encouraged to drop off passengers at the base area before they park their cars to reduce the number of riders on the parking lot shuttles. No inside dining will be allowed. However, you can still order food ahead of time pick it up at the cashier station inside when it's ready, then take it outside to eat. Purgatory General Manager Dave Rathbun said that everyone at the ski area, including guests and employees, will be required to wear a mask at all times, except when actually skiing or boarding on the slopes. We have a mission at Purgatory to give people the freedom to ski. That's what this season is gonna be really about. It's about the skiing, don't come with expectations that there's going to be nightlife, apres ski, indoor dining. Right now, it's got to be about the skiing, so that's got to be the expectation. You better come prepared to spend your day outside. Use your car as your base lodge, put your boots on at the car, throw some snacks in your own water in a backpack, keep that backpack with you all day long, and you can have a great ski day. You just are not going to be able to go inside like you may have done in the past. Protocols to ride the lift also will change this year with a maximum of five people allowed on the six passenger chairs. You have the option. So if you're comfortable and you're unrelated parties, as long as you keep one seat between you, you can have two parties go up. That's a six pack. So six people leave one seat in between. You could have the combinations of basically five people, two here, three there, one and four, as long as you leave the one seat in between. While warm weather has limited early season snowmaking, the area purchased six new fan guns with onboard air compressors that increased the production of snow by more than double. Cold weather earlier in November allowed the ski area to produce enough snow to cover six trails with at least 16 inches by opening day. Rathbun said the ski area expects to resume snowmaking with lower winter-like temperatures starting Thanksgiving week. Ski area officials note that restrictions could change depending upon health department regulations and the severity of the pandemic. Skiers and boarders are advised to check the website before heading to the mountain. Most importantly, Rathbun warned that Purgatory's ability to stay open is dependent upon everyone following all health and safety regulations if they want to keep skiing and snowboarding this year. The expectation is everybody has to follow the rules this year. If you can't wear a mask medically, don't come. If you're in a high risk category, don't come. This is not the year for that. Everybody follows, follow the rules and we can have a great and long ski season. That's what we need. And let's do this. For the latest updates about health restrictions, lift ticket purchases, weather and snow reports at Purgatory, visit purgatoryresort.com. Thanks for watching this edition of the Local News Network. Please be safe and save a life this holiday season. Wear a mask and practice social distancing. I'm Wendy Graham Settle.